guys, here's Claudio from Visual Motor WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to use Elementor WordPress Page Builder plugin in order to edit and customize your blog posts or any kind of custom post type that you want on your site in a simple, fast, effective and free method. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. I have no idea how much that helps us because you bring daily videos about WordPress SEO, plugins, optimizations, and many, many more topics, not just internet on a site's favor. So let's get this started. First thing, I'm gonna assume that you already have the Elementor plugin installed on your site and activated. It can be into the free version, no need to be pro, okay? And the first step is go to your WordPress dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus, a note, okay? In the case that you don't know how to install Elementor, we have a playlist with Elementor on YouTube, so just search on YouTube, search for Elementor Visual Moto, find our channel playlist and you're gonna be able to see a lot of videos explaining how to install, activate, customize and use Elementor. Now, review the left sidebar of menus on your WordPress website, hover mouse over Elementor and click into the submenu settings, okay? Right here we have the post type options and the most important part for us because we're gonna focus into posts, blog posts, it's that we have selected this guy right here, the post. So you must select this part. In the case that you want to use Elementor to edit any other kind of custom post type that you want on your site, you're gonna need to enable right here as well. For example, WooCommerce products, templates, theme, projects, portfolio posts, galleries, any kind of post type that your team or your site may have. After selecting posts, scroll down and hit the save change button. Now all we have to do is go to one of our posts, for example, I'm gonna edit a previously made post, this one right here, and you're gonna be able to see the button, edit with Elementor into the top center of our page. Don't click on it yet, okay? Screw it down and review, screw the page down and review the right sidebar of menus, okay? This bar when you have post and block. Summary, scroll it down, we have categories, tags, featured image, this guy right here, accept, accept. Right here, you're gonna enter with the post content, okay? Not the entire post content, just a, a small amount of words that represents what your post is about, almost like the Google meta boxes, okay? The meta tag. After entering with all your posts is about right here, okay, for example, a tweet about how your post did it, have the contents, you're gonna hit the update button or hit the publish button to have the post saved, okay? And only after this that you're gonna want to edit with Elementor. This is very, very important because Elementor gonna load another editor style, okay? And this another editor style may potentially broke your site or may potentially delete what you have made into the previous editor style so save change okay right here we have elementor and we can customize this in the way that we want for example review the left side bar menus and you can enter with images you can enter with headings You can apply columns, for example, and enter with different contents into each column. Just like this. And you can keep editing your WordPress blog post using Elementor. After doing your changes, hit the update button. Just remember, if you edit the Elementor, the, your blog posts using Elementor, you won't be able to edit it, your posts again using Block Editor, okay? Because the styles are not compatible. If you go back to the Block Editor, the WordPress Gutenberg, you won't be able to edit these contents, okay? So, it is. Now you can edit your blog posts using Elementor in a simple, fast, effective, and free method. And it is. Before anything, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to choose the comment section below, in the case that you have any question, don't forget to check out our Visual Moto Borderless plugin to gain widgets, elements, templates and tools to build up your site using Elementor or Gutenberg, or Enzu WordPress theme, the best WordPress theme you can install to customize your site in the way that you want. 
the growth.net platform, a place where you can submit your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts on your site. In addition with our sites.gallery, a CSS gallery where you can promote your site, your app, your landing page, your game design. And finally, in the case that you want to go premium while doing your site, go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass and unlock full access to our entire template library with hundreds of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click. In addition for premium blocks, assets, tools, templates, plugins and many many more topics in order to choose internet on site's favor. So let's get this started. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best.